haven't thought about why it is we wait till January to do things that we know we should do, need to do, ought to do. Let me explain. Sure, January 1st is the start of a new year, but it's relatively arbitrary. In my life, and I imagine in most of your lives, there's not a whole lot that changes because it magically becomes 2020 from 2019. Still got the same job, same house, same bills, same friends, same significant other, whatever the case may be. Nothing's really changed, at least not because we change a date on a calendar. We change from month to month. We change from day to day. What makes January significant? Is it because we view it as a fresh start and we think, oh, now let me do this thing. So often I hear myself and others say, as soon as we get to the new year, that's when I'll begin. That's when I'll start. That could be July when you hear someone say that. Why is that the case? Here we are, beginning of January, and you probably have some things, resolutions, whatever you want to call them, that you'd like to do better at, that you'd like to do more consistent at, that you'd like to uh, spend less or eat better or exercise more or find a new job or whatever the case may be. You have a list of things that you'd like to try to do. We all do. Whether we write them down, whether we formalize it or not, in our heads we think about the things we'd like to do better. Why do we wait for January? Why that arbitrary day? The reason I bring this up, it's some crazy statistic that by the end of January, like 80% of resolutions have failed. And then you wait for the next January to try it again. Why? On the things I want to do better, I started December. That's what I did this year. Because there's something arbitrary about it. I decided I needed to do some things better. That's when I'm going to do them. Why the arbitrary date? Think about it. Talk to you next time.